Hey, look, it's Luna! <laughs> <laughs> buddy systems! I found my buddy, you see? Kiyombe, what's your buddy? Hi, she guys, I'm gonna go far over here now. Goodbye! He was your friend! Yes! See, she's with the buddy. Your Do you friend. want me to meet your friends? Oh, uh, okay. Hi. Uh, hey. Yes, yes, these are the, these are my friends that I just met not too long ago. Hello. This is Elendrio, we call her Ellie. Hello. Hi. Do you want to come about to? <laughs> yes, I like that. Very good. Right. And this, this is Luna. Nice to meet you. Luna. This is my other friend, Tarina. <laughs> and then we have someone else, but she had to be pulled away for a personal business. Her name is Admana. Yes, she's gone for the moment. <laughs> Tarina's her niece. Oh. Well. Kianthe and I were just going to have a bit of a, a skirmish, as monks do. Reunion spar. Sounds fun to me. Have fun, don't die! I'll try! <coughs> Monk fight! Okay, yeah. monk's death! Roll! And roll! Success. Roll! Roll! Ah. Ooh, okay. Okay, my initiative was 15. Alright, Raheem goes first. Darn. So, he, um, <clears throat> leans his staff against a tree and pulls off one layer of his monk robes, so, like, under- But the picture you showed me, yeah. there's not much left. <laughs> <laughs> I put more he on tie, him. He ties the belt a bit tighter and then just takes it off his shoulder and it's just <laughs> sitting there. <laughs> it sizzles off his shoulder. <laughs> this sizzles. Sparkle. Glistens. He glistens, not sparkles, excuse you. <laughs> we haven't even fought yet. <laughs> it's just his aura, man. <laughs> I'm trying to not... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm trying to not turn him into a beefcake here. <laughs> okay. Trying? <laughs> not trying. <laughs> this is all me, don't worry about it. Okay, I'm so... Um, I'm having the one. I'm the one he, having he pulls off one layer of his cloak, and underneath he has one... Another layer. Yeah, there's like, you know, he's like the How shirt thing are. that has one shoulder mm -hmm. and goes across his body and then he has just like flowy, loose fitting pants. And, um, he sets up his, he like, put, he takes a stance and then, uh, so are you ready? So I, I do the same thing where I just remove some of the more decorative layers. My clothes, I just have the basics. Take off your clean gloves. <laughs> no, those stay on. <laughs> you do just like a dramatic drop? No, no, no. I, I fold them, obviously. And I dust off the area where I place them. <laughs> trying to make sure it's clean. Raheem, I'm for sure, is just kind of like... Take a nice... He knows. He's takes waiting. Your time. Take a He's nice... very patient. Ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> All ten minutes, making sure everything is nice and tidy. And then I get back to myself. And, uh... My sword is off on the side too, I guess, because he put his staff away. As well. uh, so he says, "Do you want to do weapons or just fists?" Let's let's keep it interesting and do without weapons for today. You see him take out the darts that he had and then um, drop them as well. Drop them. Okay. Drop them darts. <clears throat> put the sword on the side. Okay, so we already rolled initiative, so he's gonna just go right for you. All right. Oh, good. He runs towards you. I so terribly want to see you die. <laughs> okay, wow. you know, all right. So um, he hits you. <laughs> okay. Breaks his rope. He hits you. <laughs> I, I thought we were sparring. <laughs> oh, that's a um, crumble. In this game of life, there is no. <laughs> oh god. Form shimmer is trying to do the. Comes at you. Oh, no. And he lands a quick like. He feints to the left and then like comes with a quick like jab. Oh yeah. And then hits you for Oh, oh right on, sir. <laughs> hits you for four <laughs> points. Okay, four points oh, damage. Do you think got the point? <laughs> and he's Jay gonna oh, come go in for another attack and he misses. So he's gonna go for another jab and then like goes up for this like um, another like just a this hook, here we go, hook. I know where it's he goes in for a hook. But you just deftly step back and bat it away. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Okay. All right. It's your turn. And then I attack. I attack him. I forgot. How to, every time I start a fight, I forget Roll how to. Roll a d20. Go. Roll a d20. I got a twelve plus seven. Yes. So that's a number higher than seven. Twelve plus seven. Nineteen. Nineteen. That's a nineteen. Yeah. You hit him. Great. And then I roll this thing. 
A four plus a five. Oh I hit him for nine. Nine. Okay. Monk stuff. I'm gonna do the same thing again for my second hit, right? Mm-hmm. Do it again. Okay. That was a one plus seven, so that was an eight. Uh, you hit him. One. That was a hit him? That wasn't that one, you're right. That did not him? hit him. Okay. So, that, yeah, okay, we're even then. Okay, so you hit him for nine. Alright, so... I'm just like right on the nose, like a shark, or what? <laughs> <laughs> so little rabbit punch. Yeah, get him right, yeah, you just, just tease him, but Boom. it goes too far. <laughs> <laughs> That's why my that one fails, I'm like, oh shoot, I'm so sorry. <laughs> He's just like, huh. Okay, does a... This is on my armor class, right? He is gonna go for a flurry of blows. <gasps> does a 14 hit? My armor class is 16. That does not hit. Okay. Oh. Just, whoop. Um, 17. So he hits it with one. Pop! Pop. Pop, pop. How much is your unarmed attack? Oh. Uh, I'm on D4 plus 5? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh... Okay, he does nine points to you. Oh! Oh, and it hits you again. Oh, please don't. I might actually die. Take all the points. <laughs> he uh, so like the first one, he goes and throws really for a kick, <laughs> but you like you block it off of your your hands, and he, then with after that, he follows up with right up with like this undercut in right straight into your yeah, ab was, yeah. abdomen and just wings the wind you, out of it. Yeah. the wind. And so then after, and then he hits you again, and one, hit you for another eight. I'm sorry, how alive am I supposed to be after this? <laughs> how nine? many points do you have? I don't know. After he hit me with the nine, I had three points left. I don't oh, know. okay. We'll make this last longer. <laughs> he knocked you unconscious! <laughs> We're good <Thank> friends. You <laughs> Hey! I got a nine on him once. Well, he's, well, he's like your teacher. He is my teacher. Yeah, and then he's just like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Excellent. so he knocked you out. Okay, do I have just zero hit points now? Yeah, you're just... <laughs> Congraciously just lands like a starfish. <laughs> on my back or something like that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> she can't hear you, honey. He goes over and... What uh, level is he anyway? I made him six. Well, of course he beat me up. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. So he crashes over next to you and um, <laughs> we'll say we'll um, let's see, he does. He, yeah, we'll say he patches you up. Well, I mean, I'm Thanks. Him. Patches you up with a, a little medicine kit. Do I like wake up at all? I'm just like, oh, what the heck was that? So you have like. You wake up in his arms. Hey, oh. He's not holding me, man. He's like crashing over me. Like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> he crashes over you, like, and then he pulls out his medicine kit and, and cleans you off because he, oh. he he didn't give you a nosebleed. <laughs> then... Well, he was just doing punches, so it was probably like non-lethal. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And uh, you do regain three hit points, so you're back up. Okay. <laughs> I'm very dazed. <laughs> <laughs> Alfie just kind of like, kind of lays on the ground and sees Raheem over her and was like, Oh, you're just as good as I remember. <laughs> hey, you're pretty, pretty good yourself. <laughs> that was a good punch. I'm matching nosebleeds. <laughs> it's disgusting. <laughs> he looks down and he's like, Oh yeah. <laughs> and then he stands up and offers his hand. Okay. You grab him and pulls you up. Okay. Yeah, you're doing your footwork's better. Oh, thank you. Yeah. I have a thing I might have to sit down, though, for a little bit. <laughs> he, he, like, he, he grabs, like, your arms, and he's like, yeah, you've even, like, put on a bit of muscle. Oh, great. I'm just, like, trying not to fall over right now. <laughs> and so, Kathy's, like, also trying to kind of, like, bow, because that's what you do at the end of a 
a match. She's about to like kind of tip over toward him again. <laughs> it's kind of. <laughs> so it's yeah, Peter and I was never one for formality anyway. So like, <laughs> okay, he arms his arm shoulder. over, and then like you guys go back to a bench. Okay, great. If we sit back down. So and next, I look around to see if my friends saw me get beaten up. I think we watched it, and then <laughs> we're going in. Okay. <laughs> 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 Let's go inside. <laughs> Have fun with the buddy system! <laughs> you guys are really adamant on the buddy system thing. It was just her. Yeah. It's a safety precaution. <laughs> God. Alright, so back in the Hall of Halcyon. <laughs> okay. I take her to the Archdruid. Okay, the Archdruid <laughs> currently is Taking just enough. he's still like leaning on his staff. Hey, Luna, do we have to do we have to bow? I don't Um I didn't I don't and he know. didn't get mad. I don't um, know how this works. I never met an Archdruid before. Excuse me? Archdruid what was his name again? <laughs> uh, excuse me, Archdruid. Uh, Terrafont? It was a ter uh, terrible? Terrafont. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Since like Luna didn't give me the name, just like, oh Mr. Turtle. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, well, uh, he, he, he keeps sleeping. Mm -hmm. uh, excuse me, sir, like, kind of, like, poke him a bit on the shoulder. <laughs> oh, you're back! Yeah, oh. my friend. Hi. She's down here. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Did you, did you bow to him? I did, like... I kind of did a wave and a bow. I was... <laughs> He's like, that's very nice. <laughs> so, and are these all of your friends? Um, well, one's kind of resting. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I like doing that. <laughs> uh, it's me and Ellie that need the blessing. Oh, yes, of course. Now, we miss Ellie. Friend Luna was telling me that you had trouble with demons entering your dreams. I, uh, yeah, I, I guess they saw me as a target because I don't know people's been saying that I'm a spirit walker. Ah, uh, yes. I don't know what that is. Oh well, it means that you share a connection. To the, well, the spirits, and you know, they're just like people. Some are good, some are not so good. But think of it this way: you can do things that other people cannot, and that is both a blessing. Then that is a blessing. Now, sometimes you might be. Uh, did. This is true, but you can learn a thing or two. I can teach you a thing or two. I can help you out. Yes. So what Miss Priscilla wants to do is what we'll do is we will have to essentially ward off your dreamscape. Yes? And but to do that we'll have to free your dreamscape subconscious fears. Yes. So what this means is that I will place you and Luna and any other friend that you wish to bring with you and then you will do battle with your fears. Afterwards, then we can ward off your mind at least for the dreamscape. I mean, I think that would be pretty good. We should try to bring our friends too. Okay. Um, do you want to do this? I mean, I don't want to be an endangerment to all of you guys. Sure. Great. What do we need? Maybe we should wait for... for Kianthi! The... Yeah, she's still kind of sleeping. Maybe we should. Is it right if we wait for Keonthi to. I'm just getting kind of antsy, but she's sleeping. <laughs> well, I'm just gonna be her at the 
I'll be here at the shrine. Out of game, I'm saying just take a short rest so then Kian that you can get her HP back. Okay. I'll be right here. Just meditating. Sometimes I'm sleeping. <laughs> no one can tell. No one can tell. <laughs> You've gotten into two fights in the last hour, my girl. Yeah. What was the first one? The horse! The horse. Oh well, yeah, that, that was, was an hour ago. That was a dream. Okay. Um, oh, it it knocked me down to nine, so like... So... I understand the pain. Our health! So, Kristen, well, during a, during yeah, a short know. rest, you can roll your hit dice to recover HP. This? It's a, I believe it's Not a D8 for monks. Oh. And at level two, you have two hit dice, so you can use all of them, or you can use one of them. During my I, short rest? Yeah. Okay. I might be good to use all of them. I don't know. Yes, it's a D8, yeah. Mine was a one. Mine was a one. Might as well use the other one. Might as well use you. That was a three. So I gained five points. I'm about at half That's... my whole health, health. Okay. And Don't you also have I'm, your constitution modifier? Is that a different, or is that just Oh, I, I think it is. I thought I already added it. I don't well, know. Really? I don't know. When you, uh, so I don't think so. Actually, yeah, I don't think so. I think that's just for maybe getting HP. HP. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and here, I'm going to come up to you and be like, Hey, spirits, do you think you can help, um, Oh. Help Kay out. Help her out. And I'm gonna, in a couple of just like little light globules are gonna come out and I'm casting Healing Word. Okay. Finally, someone who can heal people. I can heal people. I just thought you were gonna, like, you know, I was trying to, like, you know, ship you guys. <laughs> you can guess what? Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. Oh, you're talking about the guy. But it's okay. Me and this. He has the other You get four HP. I get four more HP. I like, I like that. Like, Whoa! That's a much better. That is a statement! <laughs> <laughs> and that's. Let's just ignore that hat at the table. I don't know what's going on. Just ignore us. It's not worth it to pay attention. Okay. It is when you talk louder than the microphone. You can hear, you know? <laughs> All right, that's I don't know. all right. That was helpful. Thank I you so much. I will say, have access to an arch druid. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Let's just bring her in now. Luna's brain is kind of going crazy. With the <laughs> with like, what are my supposed? Is Raheem gonna join us? I mean, like, it depends on what you guys say. I mean, as far as he knows. Kayanthi rested for an hour and then went back inside. Okay. Well, I don't want to say goodbye to Raheem. Do you want to ask Raheem to join you in yeah. the escape? I mean, well, I'll ask him to where he Our plans on going. Well, we're not really leaving. We're, I believe the dreamscape's still going to be in our mind, so we can see him after the dream. Are you still by Raheem? I don't know. I thought, I don't know. I, thought I, don't we were know. I want Raheem to come walk with me into the druid place, man. Luca's arm, take him home. Okay. Well, you need to ask him. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. We'll say, like, that he, uh, he brought you back into the Hall of Halcyon and then okay. said, I'm gonna go back to meditating. Oh, okay. And then, so he's right back where he was. <laughs> Let me know when, if you're about to leave the town, okay? I'll, I'll do the same for you if I leave. Yeah. I'll just be right here meditating. I know, I did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was down. This ain't no Napoleon dynamite. <laughs> okay. Now I'm back with you guys. Hi. Yeah. Okay, so. Blessing. Yes. What's happening? <laughs> We're gonna go into their dream. The one oh. with the demon in it. Oh. We're trying to get rid of the demon. That's the point. I will make sure nothing happens. By killing their insides. You're making this worse for me. <laughs> of course, going in there to fight their subconscious fears. Oh, why? What's your name? Oh, I am <laughs> Alphorian Terrified. Nice to meet you. I am Kayanthi Nenmire. 
Oh, such of a polite young lady. I am of the Nearing Dawn Monastery. My friends were here. No, I'll just come along. Oh, yeah. 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 He was quite, he's quite strong, did you know? Well, I'm a terrible person. He's pretty strong That arms. makes more sense. sense. He's over the springs. Okay, and then Jack and I'm assuming it's fancy fantasy spelling. Okay. Now, are these your friends? Yes. Alright, so what we need to do is have you two already share a connection to our druids. Yes. But if we want to bring your friends in, they will have to consume part of you. Uh, I, I usually suggest some tears, which is a bit weird, but a little better than other options. Oh, what if just like a hair wrapped in something else, or like? Can they just eat this and then like rip off a leaf? Ow! <laughs> oh, I mean it is part of. So I feel like my uh, father's never had to do this. Uh, okay. okay. If you don't want to do it, guys, it's fine. No. I subconscious okay. first myself. I don't want to leave you alone, Luna. I have Ellie coming. I don't want you to leave you and Luna. You and Ellie alone, Luna. <laughs> Ellie, can I have that leaf? You Here you go. Oh my gosh. It, it's just like a leaf. Well, they have a connection to me through her. Well, we have to enter the dreamscape and you share the dreamscape, so it probably, uh, probably works. Oh, actually. would you like part of this leaf? <laughs> Tarina, would you like part of this leaf? Just like grow oregano or something. <laughs> Cilantro? Cilantro. <laughs> That's better <laughs> than oregano. Uh, I'm just gonna eat the leaf. Do you, get to, do you get to choose I what can't... you grow well, on your body? I mean, much like how people can't really choose their hair, no. Because it chose to be orange the other day. I don't think she was in too I, much control of that. Yeah, that, that, that just kind of happens. I don't really choose what Kathy's color like I like sniffing the leaf, trying to figure out what to make of it when she eats it. I'll just Oops. give you another leaf. Okay, pass Ow. it down the table. Yeah. All right, I don't need to cry. Okay, good. <laughs> ball it up into a ball. Oh, oh. Put it in my mouth. I grab like a thing of water that I have and just mm. down it. Like a pill. <laughs> Keanthi is a little too like taken over by the taste of leaf. She kind of expects it to taste different. Does it's it taste different? Pill. It's um leafy. Yeah, what does Ellie taste like? <laughs> <laughs> well um, Something full of chlorophyll, sure. She <laughs> yeah, she it tastes like lettuce. Oh, freaking lettuce. Oh, nice. Not, that's not really bad, bad. little... That's not I mean, bad. too bad. I'm pretty <laughs> fresh. Nice. <laughs> nice, and like it's, it's, nice and crisp. It's nice and crisp. It's like a... It's like really slightly... It's a really slight bitter, but... Okay. Like it's, it's, it's manageable. Not, yeah, it's not bad. She just like puts it... Tries to put it out, out of them her mind that it's a little bit of Ellie she's eating, but she swallows it. With great... Well... They just want to see us over with, so she's like... Alright, now so we can <laughs> gather... In a circle, yes. And he hits his. Oh, hold hands. Hold hands. Hold hands. That's all chink. Yeah, can't be happy. Air <laughs> hands. Yay! <laughs> it's his staff. Kachink, kachink. And then um, these this moss grows um, because in in the druid alcove, the, it's nice. actually dirt. Oh, okay. Because yeah. it's a druid alcove. So this moss. Uh, grows really quickly and then it like forms this magic circle around you guys and Ooh. creates some runes and then um, he hits his staff like a final time and the flowers bloom and actually some some butterflies like come out and then uh, as each of the butterflies land on your forehead you Ooh. ping go into the dreamscape. Nerd, <laughs> We're playing D and D. What do you want from us, please? You want some not be nerds? The most fun we have is rolling dice. Oh, oh. Oh. Ah, my oh. dice won. My dice beat you up. It was gonna be good. <laughs> I got <a> five. <laughs> I got eighteen. I'll roll into the cupcake tin. Didn't it, work. It nope. fell out of the cupcake tin. And a five again. <laughs> Yay. So what, what do we see? 
So, this is familiar to Luna and Elendriel, as it is the dreamscape that they, where they found um, my, uh, Maluka, Malukia and... The dead girl. And Cory. Yeah. Corey. So it's a vast grassland, and it's this, and on, on the other side of you are these trees. And it's, there's tall, tall grass. The grass is like, the grass goes up to your waist. It's really tall. <clears throat> All right. Mm. I'll go first. Okay, so Luna, you begin walking. And you hear the rustling of, of leaves off in the direction of the forest. Mm -hmm. So, we'll say you, you move that direction. Mm -hmm. And then... Putting on a brave face. Brave face. Think murder, then walk. <clears throat> and, um... Elendriel, you look... You begin to follow them, but your yeah. spirit friends actually hold you back. Oh. And they just, like... You get the sense that they just want you to wait for a minute, and then um, behind you, you see this glowing being dressed in white and green, and you recognize her as Cory. Mm -hmm. Cory? And, and she says, "Thank you for helping me." My spirit couldn't find peace until I, until Tom was taken down. I know that it wasn't the most fortunate of circumstances. And I'm sorry that, well, from your spirit friends and from what I've seen, Tom, Tom's death has released a demon into the world. But know that you did some good too. I just wanted you to know that before, before I passed on. Well, I'm glad you're able to pass on. I feel like we didn't really do any good. Well, demons are clever ones. The best lies are the ones that have truth in them too. I just don't want you to think that your gift is something that's bad. She um, turns into like glitter and fancy. Butterflies? Yeah, butterflies. Butterflies. Thanks, Cory. We'll, we'll talk again. Oh. Okay, and you continue to help. Okay, <clears throat> so. Wait, we're, all of us were going with Luna? Yeah, the three that? of you followed with Luna. Elendriel oh. stayed behind for a second. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then Elendriel. Um, you, you follow after them. And Luna, you go deeper into the woods, and you recognize this path as the path that the fake Malukia brought you. And you come to the grove. And at its... <clears throat> the grove with the little pond. Could I interrupt out of character for a bit? Uh-huh. Are we glowing like they were glowing before? Yeah, actually, yeah. Do we notice? Oh, cool. Um, yeah, you, you do. Okay. Which color are you again? Red? Yeah. Yes, I'm red. Mm -hmm. yeah. Red. Red, purple, blue, green. So you guys glow. It's it's kind of, it's more of a subtle thing. Yeah. Um, because it's not as dark in this dream. Um, okay. Likely because it's, uh... We're dreaming in the day? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Daydreaming. <laughs> okay. Daydreaming. So you guys go and see at the foot of the, the pond, there is a shadowy form. And... Do I have my sword in the stream? Yeah. yeah. Alright, I'm going to put my hand on my sword. Like right here, there. Ooh. So... 
as soon as you put your hand on your sword, the shadowy creature um, <laughs> stops. <laughs> <laughs> A little com comedy there. Guys, go back to action. <laughs> It can't, it's, it can only detect movement! <laughs> Stops. And it lets out this... It's a cat. Noise. <laughs> then it forms into a feline form with six legs and three tails. <laughs> into a monstrous oh boy. black beast. You're scared of cats on the inside? No. <laughs> and then it pauses and changes form again. <laughs> Sorry. And this time, it's my dad. <laughs> <laughs> it's Professor Snape. <laughs> and a hat. <laughs> and then and it, nice it turns dress. into. We'll say it turns into like um just this um. Well, uh, you're not afraid of like any animals, are no. you? No. Ask her what it looks like. What does it look like? Yeah. Uh -huh. It's the shape of your, it's a, a fear. A fear? Mm -hmm. I don't know. All her fears are mostly like abstract. Okay, so <laughs> it turns into like basically this arm amorphous blob type thing. It's, cool. it's hard to understand. I guess. Yeah, I just um, it's like we'll say that it it um, it's it is like it's a Lovecraft esque monster. Yeah, like yeah, it certainly. is cat like, but then like its mouth. Like curls back, whoa, and opens, the and giant like, alien really, thing coming out. Yeah, and it has like just these rows of teeth, just like you know, like turtle teeth. Oh god! Oh. So it's like, oh it's my like, gosh! Guys, I'm, scared it. <laughs> yeah. I'm scared of it. I'm scared of it. This creature doesn't make any sense. <laughs> no, it doesn't. That would be fearful. I would yeah. be scared of that. And that's where we'll end today. Oh. No! Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you guys are gonna fight the dream demon. Well, it's not really it, the the lunar sphere.